Let me introduce you guys to one of the best players in Arena Breakout right now. Kiwi, a legendary rank pro player who is just destroying every single lobby right now, killing all the best players in the game, taking all their loot and then dipping. In this video, I'm going to be reacting to his gameplay and also analyzing and giving you guys some tips and tricks on how to play like Kiwi. So without further ado, let's kick it. All right, let's get cracking chat. Where's he spawning? Staging area spawn. Mask up, mask down. I think he was trying to see if it was actually up or down. Popping his red stim straight away. Um, when people pop red stims, you know that they're pretty good because they know how to use the red stims. Kiwi is a very aggressive player. So that's why he's going to be popping a lot of red stims here. Now remember guys, I haven't seen this at all. This is my first time actually opening this video. I asked Kiwi to... Um, I asked Kiwi to send me, a, 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 you know, his, his best play and I'm going to react to it. So whenever I do my reacts, it's always raw. I don't watch it beforehand, not even a bit. So hopefully, hopefully it's a banger. I mean, I have all faith in Kiwi that's going to be a banger anyway. He hears shots towards barn. So instead of rotating into, um, instead of rotating into tank entrance, he's, he's going to chase those shots. Takes high ground to try and find out where the enemies are. This is called a mountain, by the way. This spot is called the mountain. And you can snipe all the way to the field hospital from here. It's pretty crazy. All right, he... Ooh. Ooh, damn. God damn. That's a real player, guys. Holy. Yo, where did this guy come from? So I'm guessing that this guy spawned here. So this was his spawn. Right? This is a shooting range spawn right next to the um right next to the tank entrance. Oh, he's gonna go for the Tetris. FA multi into his bag. FA multi is very, very good for Tetrising, guys. Um, it has 18 slots, but only uses 16 in your backpack. So it's a very, very good um rig to put in your backpack to carry more stuff. I think it's 18. I need to confirm that. Right, popping a tank entrance. He's got one player kill already. Wait, hold on. He's carrying 30 round mags. Instead of a instead of the typical 50 round mag for the foul. Ooh. Wait, was that a was that a real player? I'm not quite sure, because there's a scav bot up there up there normally. Oh, another headshot. God damn. Yo, that's at least two player kills. My God, his aim is insane, guys. He's only carrying 30 round mags. That's actually insane. Oh, wait, no, no. He's got a 50 round mag. Oh, hold on. So he's switching to his 30 round mag, I think for faster mobility. I'm not quite sure why he's switching to his 30 round mag. Maybe he has his M61s in this mag, but his 50 round mags only got M80s for bots, for example. Because you don't need many bullets if you're wearing an M61. Ergonomics is this is quicker as well. So when you've got a smaller mag, so aggressive yeah so when you're wearing a smaller mag guys your ergonomics is better because it's a lighter mag and therefore your ads time is gonna be quicker i'm not sure if it affects movement speed though i don't think it does yeah he must be wearing m61 on his 30 round mag yeah he is look he's, he split it he split it so what he's done here is it's because he's playing solo he needs he needs good bullets for the pvp and a lot of bullets for the bots, which is T4 in his 50 round mag. See, there you go. This is this is called efficiency, guys. This is called efficiency and knowing what the hell you're doing. So we got a headshot on the guy on the artillery side on the rock. I'm not sure if he actually, I don't think he actually killed him. He should have killed him because if this is the same guy, then he's only wearing what? Is that T3? T T4? Um, and his M61. He should have killed him one shot, so... He must be on about three player kills now, I think? Or four. I'm not too sure. So we kill... I think he killed someone up here. Yep, there we go. He killed him. Four kills. Jeez, bro. 
Checking them tags. He's always checking. He's constantly checking where people could be. Oh, that's another player. Hello. God damn. That's fast. So that's four kills off the bat, guys. Four kills off the bat. Holy, that was fast. He just literally deleted those guys so quick. His aim is really good. Tap fire as well. Absolutely insane. Yo, this isn't even a, um, a high-end foul, guys. It just looks like a, a budget build foul. Popping those red stims again. As I said, as I said to you guys, he always pops these red stims because he's a, he's a very aggressive player. He likes to move around. Rotate all the time. He's not even going in the bunker. He's literally just looking for people. Hello. That's a bot. His movement is just flawless. His transitions from one, one space to another is just perfect. He knows where to look straight away. And he's constantly checking, man. He's constantly checking. He is moving. He doesn't... He's not He's not one of those slow, slow peekers or whatever. But this is someone who's very confident in his movement abilities. He did hear a shot in barn earlier, so... Because the guys hasn't really rotated to, to, to radar base. He thinks they're still here. Because this is where he heard the shots earlier, so they, the, the people might still be looting. Dead bots here. No footsteps, though. Look at that. No unnecessary jumping. Just very efficient shoot. Uh, just very efficient movement. Shots at radar. Uh, that's either radar or gas. I don't know if it, it saw it or not. But he's searching this place anyway. Oh, here we go. He's on, he's on the ground. The guy is on the ground. Yeah, I think... I'm pretty sure the guy is on the ground. Footsteps right next to him now. Literally just where he was. Scanning the entire place. Oh, he's backing up. Oh, yeah, he's going to the other place. Oh, nice. Ooh! Nice. That guy's hurt. Very hurt. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he actually killed him. I thought he just hurt him. I thought he just broke his arm or something. Look at that taking his time. That's five PKs right there. He's so aggressive, man. He's literally so aggressive. Aims really good. Rotations are fantastic. This is a very tricky push. He can't exactly just jump down here because he could get naded. So he's taking his time a little bit. Right now, time to push. Oh, straight dead. Good lord. Instant droppage, man. I think there's one more here. There's definitely one in barn. I'm not sure if they're the same team or what. Oh, look at that. Look at that flicky, flicky. Check, check for them corners, guys. Raiders. These are raider bots. Jesus, these guys have been looting. <coughs> Nothing crazy, though. Nothing crazy so far. He's literally just deleting everyone. I might start using the fall again. Oh! Oh, target module. Let's go. 400k right there, baby. 400k. Hey, yo. 
That's dope. That he got lucky there. I wonder where those guys found that tier target module. See, guys, you don't need to go into the bunker to get rich from armory if you don't want to. You can literally just loot the outside and then you'll find a target module out here somewhere. Oh, he's on M6. Oh, he's on BPs. I was going to say. Look at his peaks, man. His peaks are so clean, guys. So clean. Oh, what the hell? All right, there's one more in barn. There's definitely one more player in barn. But he's taking his time. He's taking his time looting these guys. Oh, this guy was T6. T6, T5. God damn. No, T6, T6. Yeah, yeah, T6. Sheesh. What was he using, though? Like, weapon-wise. He's literally just wasted his money. BP rounds. I mean, it's not that bad, but... I'd honestly rather invest in better ammo... Um, better ammo weapon combo than... Than a best. I heard someone moan. Someone got hurt there. I think he killed him. He might have killed him. He's gonna drop his bag. There you go. He's going for the aggro push. Oh, he's still there. He's going for the push. Oh! T6! Oh my god, bro! Deleted! Jesus! He heard him with that grenade. And then pushed him a little bit more. That's crazy. Jeez. All right. Um, this could be the whole lobby wiped. This could literally be the entire lobby wiped, chat. I think he's killed like six. Six players. Yeah, yeah, six. Maybe even seven. I've, I've, I've kind of lost track. Oh, my God. He's literally just deleting everyone he sees. You see, guys, it's not just the Timmy's he's been killing at the start. He's also dropped two, C uh, two T6s now. Two of them. Heels, heels. The entire lobby is here. I mean, the entire lobby is his. I wonder how much he's going to come out with. He's got a Power Rangers helmet as well down there. So that's like, what, at least... That's like 100... 100... 100k. 120k at least. Depends on how much he destroyed it. Damn. I might start copying this loadout though. I've missed playing with a foul. Foul used to be my favorite weapon before it got nerfed. Because I, I rely a lot on hip, hip fire. That's my favorite thing to do. When they nerfed foul by minus 15 base hip fire. Which is... That's really, really bad. So I don't... I don't know if I'm still gonna... If I'm still going to enjoy foul, to be honest. Oh, this Tetris thing is still picking up all the nades. He's not even picking up the um, the purple items. Yeah, he's not going to he's not going to pick him up. They're, they're, they're just not worth it. Yeah. So what's going to happen is if he needs the green aids, he'll have them. But if he picks up the um, the purple items like the gas analyzer and takes up two slots to get rid of two grenades, he needs to buy those grenades anyway. And those grenades are like 4.5k each. So if he doesn't end up using a grenade, he still saved the money for not picking up the gas analyzer. S see what I'm saying there, yeah? So you don't just have to... You, you don't just pick up all the, all the loot that you can find. Ooh, MK14. Hello. Hello, mate. You might be able to Tetris with this. Oh, oh, 250 round mags. God damn. Here comes the Tetris. Here comes the Tetris. He's going to put it on the gun. Can he put it on the gun? No, unfortunately, no. He doesn't have the mod. That would have been cool. So what he was trying to do there, he was trying to put that laser onto the gun to save more space. But it doesn't have the um, the base part for the for the, um, for the the laser to put it on the gun. He's so heavy. He can't even run. 
Wait. There's still... There's still 18 minutes left into the video. Is he gonna go into the bunker? Hmm. Interesting. Look at that. He's literally looking for... Looking for campers. He's, he's, he's literally meticulously checking out all the area. Look at that. Every corner. Taking his time. This is a high level player right here, guys. Even though this is, is very quiet, even though that he might have killed everyone, he's still very careful. And this is something that I need to improve on myself. Whenever I hear silence and I think, mm, I, I think I've killed everyone, I'm just, I'm just running around mindlessly. But look at him, he's checking everything. Drop this bag in the middle of the road so we can still run around very, very efficiently and quickly. And now I think he's going to go back towards the, um, the switch. Yup, he's going back towards the switch. Look at that, just, just constantly checking everywhere. There's always one, guys. Always think there's always one more. Pop in the reds. Here we go again. Yeah, I wonder if he's gonna go into the bunker to try and actually find better loot you can see a lot of us including myself you know i'm not a high level player if this was me i'd extract well it depends on what i'm trying to do if i'm just there for the pvps then maybe i'd stay more stay a little bit longer maybe about another 10 minutes to try and figure out if there's anyone else here that i can kill but if i'm on a looting spree i would probably dip yeah because bunker solo is just very, very, um, very, very annoying to do on your own. The boss would give you an annoying time, but hey, Kiwi probably doesn't care about that. Oh, oh, damn. You see, my aim is a lot worse when a person is just standing still. I can hit harder shots. Better than I can to someone just standing still. Is anybody else like that? I did not know you can get up there. Legit didn't know you can get up there. Alright, so he's gonna go pick up his bag again. This guy, bro. This guy is so efficient. So he went to go and clear the area first. He dropped his bag. Because he's very heavy, he's not going to be mobile, and it's not going to match his playstyle, right? So we dropped his bag. He's going to go for another loot. Oh my god. Yep, this guy's. This guy's leaving no crumbs, bro. This guy is literally leaving no crumbs. He doesn't, he doesn't like wearing the, um, the Power Rangers helmet here either. Because the, um, the minus movement speed reduction penalty on that helmet is huge, guys. Absolutely massive. So he's not, he's not using the Power Ranger helmet because it's going to slow him down. So in terms of, like, playstyle, it's very similar to mine. I love the movement speed and being able to run around very quickly. Footsteps, that's inside, I think. Look at that. Checking them footsteps. Oh, what that? <laughs> oh, he's going. Oh, yo, he's going for the bunker, bro. Damn. Damn. He's going for the bunker for more loot. Holy. All right. I see you. Yeah, he opened it earlier. Oh, oh, wait, what? That bot was literally standing still, bro. That bot was standing still, not doing anything. What the heck? That bot was literally stood there for so long because he was out here. And then that bot just wasn't moving at all. That's actually ridiculous. No usable mags found. He dropped it on the floor somewhere. Ooh. 
Wait, did he drop it inside? Or did he drop it out there? I didn't even notice when he did that. Oh no, don't tell me he's lost his mag. There's no shot. He lost his mag. Wait, did he lose his mag? So he's got a 50 round on at the moment. But his 30 round mag with the M61's missing. Unless I'm being blind here. Look at that. He retreats all the way back to shooting range spawn to heal. Because he knows he could get pushed out there. How much time does he have left? Let's have a look, chat. 14 minutes. 14 minutes left on the clock. He's looking for that mag. He lost his mag, bro. <gasps> no way. Happens to the best of us, chat. Happens to the best of us. He lost it. He actually lost his mag. No shot. Oh, he's angry at the bots now for losing his mag. He's looking for his mag, bro. What the heck? He's totally lost it. There it is. Bloody hell. All right. So, guys, he, he put his mask up there. I have no idea why. I was going to say, did he purposely put that mask on to run around or not? Because apparently, if you have your mask up, you consume less stamina when you're running. I haven't actually fully tested that, but that makes sense. It completely makes sense. The same way as you lose less stamina when you're proning and you're aiming down your side. You lose stamina slower. So it makes sense if, if there is a mechanic around that. All right, he's gonna go for the, um, for the bots clear now. Look at all this loot, guys. He's not even he's not even been inside the bunker. Bloody hell. Here we go. Here we go, chat. Oh! He should have just shot that door. So, guys, a bit of a trick. When that door is opening and there's someone behind it touching the door, and you can see them through the door, shoot them because the bullets will go through. See? Right there, look. Yeah. See? You can wall bang them. Nice. Good job. Jaddy taught me that. Who is also his friend. Do you guys know who Jaddy is? He's another streamer for, um, for Arena Breakout. Cool guy. Really nice guy. He is literally a stims addict, bro. It just goes to show... It just goes to show how important stims are in this game. And this... This... This is like stims are basically what what separates the the, the boys from the men, the, the the good players to the great players. These stims are the transitional period of all right. I need to I need to start using stims so I can do more. And for those that didn't know, blue stims help you carry more. It helps your weight. It increases your weight limit. Um, the red stims are for stamina, so it allows you to run faster and it helps you get your stamina back up quicker. And the green one is health repair and health heal over time. MDR. The nice 70k right there. I wonder if he's going to go for it. What are we saying for the time? minutes I right, was going for the lounge floor for the safe I'm guessing he, he brought the key, the, the key with him I wonder if he's gonna get any more crazy loot here chat oh 
Oh, antenna. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. That wasn't even a safe chat. <laughs> that literally wasn't even the safe. I wonder why he's not picking it up though. It's 50k. Wait, did he pick it up? I think he did. I must, I must have missed it. I blinked, basically, chat. Really just taking his time. He broke that boss leg. Dead. His aim is so good. His aim is so good, man. I think he's a gyro player. I'm not quite sure. He does have a bit of a screen shake. Yeah, look right there, look. Yeah, he, I, think he's, I think he's got gyro. Bot right underneath him. This is good though, because when he's clearing these bots, I don't think they're going to respawn later. Yeah, I'm, pre I'm pretty sure they won't respawn later. Because of when he started to clear these bots. Maybe in the very last second when he's extracted, they might respawn, but they shouldn't do. He's killed everything now. So I think he's going to drop his backpack at the canal. This jacket is really good, guys, by the way. Right next to the uh, right next to the extract. Very good jacket. Oh, look at that. Just talking about how good that jacket is. Stamp album. That's only like, what, 20k? So he's ignoring it. He just knows what he wants to pick up. He just doesn't pick things up just because he can. Nothing crazy. Blue room. He's literally got the whole armory to himself, man. So good. So fast. Oh, what's he gonna get? What's he gonna get? Tank, album, CPU. Not much. That's like what, 30k max? All of that. M62s. Jesus. He's got some good bullets here. That guy that was using the MK6 MK14 was absolutely stacked. That was the Power Rangers guy, basically. He was using the MK14. And he just deleted him. Foul supremacy, man. Foul supremacy. And he's not even using a cracked foul, though. What the hell? This is like a budget build. This is insane. Trash loot. Nothing much. Nothing much good. Alright, there's one more safe in the back. And this should be it. What are we doing for time? Seven minutes. Remind me to lower my webcam next time, guys. So, so we can actually see the, um, the, the time for the map for, for intensity purposes. Alright, nothing, nothing good here. Nothing crazy. You could go upstairs and grab the MDR for the, um, for the scope, though. Cause he's got some, he's got some space. Oh, he's heavyweight. Hella heavyweight. Oh, he's not been here. Yeah, he has, he actually hasn't been here. The first safe. This is the um, hole in the wall safe. The barrack safe. What's this? Secret document? Secret document? All right, nothing crazy. Hard rubber. He's better off picking up that stamp. There's a stamp downstairs on the um, on the jacket. I think that's what he's gonna do, right? Oh my god, he's still looting. Five minutes and fifty nine. You know what? Let's lower my webcam down. There you go, chat. So you guys can see the clock without me having to freaking do my screen business. He's literally wiped the entire armory outside of players and inside this guy is insane he's, he's literally having to crawl to the extract now though wait where's he going oh he's gonna search even more what oh he's going radar all right, okay, he's going radar extract. Yeah, radar is easier. Radar is easier than the bunker. 
Because in the bunker, the bots are really annoying to deal with. Sometimes there's five that spawns as well um, on the bottom bunker floor. And it's very, very hard to kill them on your own. Wow. All right. Okay. He's kind of surprised me there. I'm not going to lie. He's going to crawl to the, um, he's going to crawl to the radar extract first. Place his bag down. Oh, okay. He left it there. Ah, oh, saves a bit of time. Okay. Makes sense. Bangs it right in the middle. He's so efficient. Like every single, every single move that he does is just so efficient. Oh my God. He's looting. What the heck? <laughs> He's still looting. I love it. You never know, chat. You never know. You can find like key cards in here and stuff. Damn, bad luck. Better luck next time, mate. Here we go. He's using the M62s now on the um, on the MK14. He is literally so heavy right now, chat. He is crawling to that extract. Clearing out all the bots in the vicinity so they don't push in. There is a chance that that bot could push in here if he aggro's him. My god, that bot was freaking silent. You see that bot there, guys? Crouch stealth walking? Are you serious? Here we go. It's trusty foul. Nice. Popping them headshots, man. Popping them headshots, baby. All right, I wonder how much he's. Uh, I wonder how much he's extracting here, chat. Let me know. Let me know right now before he extracts how much you think he's actually coming out with. I'm guessing about 1.2 mil. Yeah, he's got a target module, couple of six uh, T6s. I, I, I'll say it's about 1.2 mil. This was literally the perfect armory run. This is one of the smoothest armory runs I've ever seen. If, if, if not perfect. Wait, what? Wait, hold on. What is that? What is that glitch that he's doing? Wait, hold on. I thought he was glitching between MK and the foul. See, look. What? What? Hold on. Hold on. Did he just... Did he just switch to his knife and into his gun? Instantly like that without the animation. That is insane. I never knew that. Please tell me I'm not the only one that didn't know that. Holy crap. Let's, let's do that again. What? No way! No way! What the hell, chat? I've actually got goosebumps. I did not know about that. Holy. Oh my god. Kiwi with the perfect armory raid. He didn't show us. Where? How much did he come out with? Hello? What the hell? You know what? I'm going to message him right now. I'm going to message him right now. I'm, I'm literally telling him. I'm telling him. Yo, bro. I'm in the middle of recording. And I'm messaging you from within the video. Tell me how much the loot was. God damn it. <laughs> what the heck? All right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna give it two minutes, chat. We're just, we're just gonna wait here for a little bit. We're just gonna wait here for a little bit and see and and see if he replies.
24 hours later. All right, so I'm even in Germany right now in a content house, and I don't even have a camera. Everything is loud. It's all wild up in here, chat. But I've got the results here anyway. All right, so we got what? One, two, three, four, five, six, six, six um, real player kills. Hold on, seven. All right, seven kills. I think that was a seven kill game, chat. One point one mil. That's insane. All right, chat. I hope that showcases the power of Kiwi. You know, the, it's just an absolutely meticulous player, high level player, good aim, good prediction, good game sense. You know what? Not even good. Replace good with great. Everything that I said, which is great. He challenged like like really great aim, long distance with a foul. Managing M80 bullets with M M61 bullets, switching in between mid game, using the right magazines for certain for certain fights, and he just knows where to look all the time. Now this is the sign of someone who is insanely at the top of their game, and you don't see a lot of players like Kiwi. So a lot of players are a little bit passive. With Kiwi, he just pushes everything. That's his style. I've seen him. I've seen him solo wipe squads in events. I, I've been with him when he solo wipes squads in events, chat. He doesn't mess around. Kiwi is a legendary player. He is one of the best game. Uh, he's one of the best players in the game right now. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you want more, um, if you want more of Kiwi's gameplay, let me know in the comment section below. If you want more reacts gameplay, more reacts videos, let me know in the comment section below as well. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Peace.